The Moonraker Watch. This is uh, famously uh, James Bond and Seiko have had quite the relationship over the ages, and uh, many Seiko digital watches were featured in the 80s, uh, 70s, 80s Bond movies. Um, this is one of them. This was from actually featured in Moonraker. Uh, there were several Seiko watches featured in that movie. This is one of, I think, three that was worn. It was uh, this model, not this particular watch, uh, was worn by Bond. Uh, it is an alarm chronograph timer watch. Uh, so this is uh, also, this is a 1979, I don't know if I mentioned it, but this is a pretty high-end or at least feature-packed watch from Seiko from 1979 uh, just because it has everything. It also has, which is pretty fantastic, the loudest beep I've ever experienced on any digital watch. Check it out. It's remarkably loud. That's because these early A229 movements actually used a separate beeper speaker system that uh, projects the sound right through this grill right here. There's a little hole. I don't know if you can see it. There's a tiny, there's there's a hole right here, and th that's behind that is where the speaker is. So it beeps directly at your face, um, which I think is a really cool feature. Let's see. So it has the alarm. It has a timer. Um, so here you can see, uh, like the other Seiko watches, the time is always displayed at the bottom and your sort of, um, your modes are at the top here above this split in half by this day of the week uh, bar, which is pretty neat. So here's your alarm. Here's the timer. Shows you actually a large countdown, small countdown. Uh, and then the stopwatch, um, all of which, you know, work. This watch... Uh, also has a light, which is, uh, again, pretty bright. Back in the in the late 70s, early 80s, these were pretty bright lights. Uh, the screen itself is very sharp uh, and very high contrast, but not as high contrast as some of the later LCD screens from Seiko. But still, it's a very cool watch. It has this super integrated bracelet. I'd say super integrated because typically... Seiko's do have inter, uh, Seiko Digitals do have integrated bracelets, but this one, the first two links of the bracelet are actually sort of fused together uh, with this little riveted bit here. So it creates a nice arch that hugs your wrist. There's a little bit of damage on this side. This watch, um, again, also had a stuck battery door. Here's a battery door here. It, battery door was stuck. I managed to get the battery door off with nothing more than uh, than a nickel and some grit and determination. So that's lucky. Luckily, that was all it needed. The watch itself was really filthy, um, and so it was has been thoroughly cleaned, both with alcohol and in the ultrasonic cleaner. Um, it is very well used, well loved watch. You can see. Uh, there's quite a bit of scratching on, or there's scratches on the surface of the glass. However, it's not too bad. I actually think it's not bad enough to replace the glass. Um, you could. These, these, uh, these crystals are available still, surprisingly, and they're not that difficult to swap. But, um, I'm not going to do it on this one. This is the original, original crystal, original glass, original everything, so... I'm going to leave it as is. Uh, the bracelet is actually quite lightweight, very thin folded links, and extremely flexible. You can see it feels almost chintzy. It is it, it is very comfortable, though. Um, and it says Seiko SQ. It's the, on all quartz, Seiko quartz watches, a lot of them have this. And that's it. This is the watch featured in Moonraker. Uh, this surprisingly, or yeah, this was surprisingly was in a bucket of watches. It was a parts watch, but it works perfectly. Uh, it was just very dirty, so I cleaned it up. It's no longer a parts watch. It's its own watch, and hopefully will have a good life ahead of it on someone else's wrist. Um, it is going on eBay. It's not perfect, but I mean, it has history. 
and also it was worn uh, by James Bond in Moonraker. So, I mean, that's pretty freaking cool. And also, you're going to wake up, you're going to wake up when this alarm goes off. Check it out. Another cool thing about these old Seikos um, feature, if you hold, when it's in time mode, you hold these two buttons on the right here. Gives you a little demo of the beep. So yeah, you're going to wake up. Very cool. Very loud. Uh, yep, check it out. Check it out on eBay. Okay, and that's it. Watch the next one.